I'm Chandler Evans, writer and director for Intuition. I'm Julie Restivo. I'm the writer of My Alibi. Well, it's this website where the community um, creates content for the shows. Um, every show has contests associated with the show and our members submit their creative work and the winners of the contest become part of the show. It's a completely interactive site. The, basically the members power the shows is what they like to say. And uh, each episode has a challenge or a couple of challenges where you upload a video, submit a picture or write a scene and that gets included into a future episode and you also win a prize like an Xbox 360, iPods, all sorts of good stuff. My Alibi is a show about teenagers, high school kids that are in trouble and they're stuck in a room together and so everyone's giving their alibis um, and telling stories. Intuition is um, it's sort of a young adult X-Files sort of meets heroes type thing where um, a young girl is on the run from a government program and she happens to have um, paranormal abilities. For My Alibi, we do a lot of story challenges. We ask for stories from people's lives, and then those stories become the character stories. So, for instance, recently we had a challenge that was asking for your worst breakup story. So the winner of that got to see their horribly traumatizing <laughs> breakup <laughs> recreated by one of our characters. Intuition. They tend to be a little bit different because a lot of the uh, they're out of context challenges, which means that they submit stuff, but they don't really know what how they're going to be incorporated. Because I have to keep the plot points a secret, because if I blow the, the you know the surprise for the episodes, it won't work. We just did one um, uh, your favorite mom moment, and people uh, you know did video blogs of some really amazing stories. I was watching this show last night, and um, the this artist, uh, he's the president of RISD, I think, he said something that really resonated with what we do. Um, he said, creative people are very comfortable with ambiguity, and I felt like that's so true, and especially in this case, um, you have to be comfortable with ambiguity to write these shows because there's so much unknown and so much that's not in your control and that's what's really fun about it. I'm not gonna say when, but there have been a few stories that won, and I was like, oh no, <laughs> I don't like this story, I don't know how I'm gonna make this work, and then, you know, after a while brainstorming with people, um, coming up with a way to fit it in, sometimes those are the ones that have turned into the best episodes, were the ones that I resisted the most and, you know, wanted to have nothing to do with. I had one where, um uh, the contest was your favorite dessert and Peeps won and I would have never thought for Peeps as a favorite dessert so to try to figure out how to get that in and how to make it feel organic and you know who's going to be eating the Peeps and you know so it, it definitely makes you stretch and it's it's cool that uh, you know people are helping you create a vision together. We have some people that are very active and they submit to like every challenge and um, getting to kind of know their style and just what they're about as people has been really cool. It, it goes beyond just making shows together. You do end up feeling like you're making new friends on this site because you get to know people and you learn about their personal lives. And they're getting to know us too because they're trying to figure out how we're going to incorporate the challenges too. <laughs> yeah. So there's some of, some of them are trying to guess like, you know, you know, what are they looking for and cuz uh, the challenges are often, you know, somewhat generic, you know, submit a story about this or whatever and so they try to angle it so to get it in, you know, the show and stuff. So it's fun.